Hi, my name is Basi from Torchlight Production. I'm here to share with you how to use Crocodile 512 DMX controller to control your light. Today, I'm going to control an LED pattern with the Crocodile 512 Intelligence controller. Starting, I have a DMX cable connected to the lamp and I address my fixture address 001. Okay, first of all, you turn on the power of the DMX controller. The next thing you need to do is to engage the run and edit buttons. These buttons help you to grant you access to the functions of this light. So the next thing you do now, you, you click on it, make sure that the, the red lead is turned on then the next thing you need to do is just to select the bank for which you want that light, the, the activities to be saved on. So you select the bank, nothing will happen at that point. If you check on your screen here, it will, as it, it will say here, edit chess, the moment you press that. So the next thing that you need to do is to select the fixture. Remember it was on 001, so you select 001. Now, whatsoever you touch here on this board will respond, the light will respond to it. So what do I really need to access now? I, I want to access the colors in this light. So channel one here is about, is the dimmer. So I push it to the maximum so that whatsoever color I will touch will, will respond. So I push the first color, which is red. Second one green the third one blue i can even also i can also decide to combine the two colors with by moving two feathers at different proportion and to have different other colors there's one thing you need to know also this is a blackout button if this blackout if the red lead of this blackout button is on any any input you give here will not come out for example look at that I move this, I do that, the light is not responding. But the moment I turn off the blackout button, that light will now come on. So this helps you to cut off whatsoever activities you were using the controller to do without necessarily having to pull down these feathers one by one.